Hello, collective. Hello, collective. I just cleaned in here in the living room. I swept them off. It smells so much better. So, and then I use my sage. I have it over there on the side of my couch. So, I hope you're all doing well. And welcome to Pam Star Oracle. I'm Pam. Nice to meet you all. And hopefully I can give you something that will help you today in your journey. And if, if none of this rings true, then... It might not be for you. It might be for somebody else. It might be energy that hasn't hit you yet. It, you just never know. It could be old past energy. But just remember to uh, use your common sense and discernment. Okay, collective. Uh, what does my collective need to be aware of today? And if you're new and you like what I do, hit subscribe and hit all. And you'll be notified every time I upload here on YouTube. Okay. Somebody needs to go outside today and get grounded. That's why the tree come out. It's helping you to grow at the moment. Well, if you go outside and ground yourself and ground your energy, and remember, deep breathe in and out. One, two, five. And know that everything will be okay, whatever you're going through. Okay, and then North Node and, uh, came out, and you know, this reflects your future. If it would have been upside down, it would have been your past. So you're focused on growing out of old experiences. Maybe you're um, a generational curse breaker, whoever's listening to me, if that makes sense. But, um, hang on. That was one that I'm not going to pull out. Not for this reading. Sorry, collective. Hang on, let's see what's in here. Somebody might have, um... You got to keep remembering to stay reflected in your future and don't go back to these past things that you grew away from. Like, this is past energy, like, um... Or right now, for you all, it might be in the present energy, or it's not happened yet, but somebody might be trying to set you up for money. And this shit is totally messed up, brah. <laughs> somebody might be trying to set you up, okay? They're trying to make you out to be a bad guy or bad girl. Like, these people forget all the hell they brought into your life was all out of envy and not wanting you to keep moving forward towards your goals and dreams. But I, it says leave the toxic bunch behind and don't look back. So you've not looked back to these people that might have set you up to be harmed. You know, you've been reflecting on your future and uh, you've noticed that what you learned collective is you growed away from that, from um, being around toxic people that tries to set you up for money so you left these situations so why would you want to go back to that i wouldn't you know and i wouldn't collective i'm not dumb but uh whoever this is that set you up they might have went around lying because you didn't sleep with them in the bed so so somebody might have set you up just because you didn't sleep with them yeah that's what it's saying and that tree that came out this could be a, a family that you know or you might have worked for or some, um, some somebody that might have had a family and they didn't understand. You know what I mean? But they can't manifest anymore because they was keeping um, all this hidden. See, they can't manifest because they was keeping it all hidden. <laughs> yep. They won't be able to. Oh, and something about drunk driving collective. Drunk driving. They're trying to make you out to be a bad guy and bad girl. And this person goes around getting drunk and drives all the time. They're just a drunk that wants to uh, screw everything. I don't know who this is, collective. You all might. I don't know what in the hell it's even talking about. But It says, listen. See, your angels guided you. We all have a guide deep inside of all of us. Your guide is trying to show you that you need to trust the guidance deep within and listen to those whispers of yourself. 
you gotta learn to listen to it and that's what you uh you let go to this old you this old uh way of thinking we got to re relearn all this new knowledge when you go on spiritual path and you do you do you just start listening to yourself and it's trying to make you grow away from old toxic things and, and people and i did that's why i can talk about that and and all i know is um somebody does appreciate you being there and showing up for them like a loving warrior they think of you many times a day and they're pulling on your energy through telepathy all right listen to me now somebody and this might be from your past they might keep attaching to you um through telepathy listen telepathy listen telepathy is trying to send you towards your north node be grateful for the little things and all things so you can thrive in life baby listen listen you gotta be grateful listen you gotta be grateful it's saying don't and it says learn what real love feels like it feels light fun abundant caring and giving so so this person that pulls on your energy through telepathy they they're grateful for you they listen to you every day they know that you're not this old person and they love you they love you and um oh we're kind of fell on the floor you have a secret admirer watching you yeah and your secret admirer knows that this drunk is driving around drunk and they they're a dirty devil this dirty devil that's a drunk drives and does stupid shit that's jealous and envious um and and they went around lying that you didn't sleep with them so what it might be saying is listen this secret admirer that's watching you is somebody that's mad that you didn't sleep with them collective now this is a for you for you collective of readers is what i was talking about and for others of you uh, you you somebody is paying attention to you online and things and it it might be your twin is doing this and your twin knows that this son of a bitch is watching your channel or watching you while they drive by your house and get drunk and drive on your on a, on a, on your road and you might live on a dirt road or something like you know on dirt roads that's where they always want to drive and drunk and act stupid yeah but don't people understand that god will bring you to your twin it's all in god's timing divine timing yeah it is you know and if you look up you can look up what signs is good to be twin flames you know and i'm an aquarius and it says to me virgo if y'all if you're all just wondering and curious it does and it says uh that you'll get married real young it does but now them you y'all will be a lot different and you'll have to go around you'll It'll take a while to get to learn each other because you'll butt heads a lot. <laughs> but anyway, some Venus love energy is coming from Libra and Taurus. Oh, somebody out here. Somebody out here. Um, this secret admirer that's watching you is... Is going to bring you love. And it's a Libra or Taurus. But whoever, or whoever, they, somebody went around lied and said you was a gold digger and you wasn't. So, uh, they might want to speak to you about that, about this, whoever this other man is that went around lying on you because you didn't screw him or whatever it is. But I guess maybe this person that loves you and it might be your twin, they, they know that there's somebody holding a grudge against you and they think it's all your fault. And that they didn't even do nothing to hurt or harm you. They're holding on tight. They got a tight grip now, 919, it just said. They got a tight grip. That's what it's saying. But. Hang on a minute. What's this say? Someone might be feeling disappointed after all this crap that comes out that you see in here, collective, what all this person was actually doing to you. It says man. So, I wrote man. So, this man, uh, it's going to really surprise you when you find out everything that this son of a bitch went around a line and saying about your name. Yeah, 
<laughs> yeah. Thank you, Spirit Guides, for telling me. Ain't you all thankful of that collective that I can show us what's going on that we don't know about? Yeah. And whoever that drunk man is, that's mad you didn't screw him. Uh, they, they won't never admit that, uh, they, they do something mean to, maybe their youngins behind closed door, but they'll never admit that, because they're a drunk. They'll never admit that. They would never admit that. Somebody is going around screwing around and lying, acting like that they, they ain't doing it. Somebody's going around lying, and... <laughs> <laughs> it might be about whoever is hang on let me see what else it says twin flames twin flames Somebody might have got a mentally and psychologically abused from a narcissist. And this was all behind closed doors. And it's all coming out. That's what it's saying. But Twin Flames, uh, telepathy, intuition leads you. Uh, this is about you all going through a spiritual kundalini awakening. This is an intense connection and your soul recognizes each other. So your Twin Flame recognizes you. Your all souls are the same and you're mirroring each other at the moment and each other's actions. And that's what true twin flames do. Y'all mirror each other all the time. That's what happens. And uh, let's see, what else does twin flame in, or what do you want to talk about? Maybe it's twin flame. Uh, uh, Spirit guides is guiding them at the moment, and they guided them to run away from this person. Maybe your twin flame is friends with this other man that went around and lied. <laughs> and your twins, uh, your twin left that person because God showed them. And God has showed your twin flame that you're real. And they said, I would lay down and die for you just so I can lay beside you in a casket. That's right next to yours for eternity. That's why many pounds star oracle. So this, this man would lay down and die for you. This twin flame would lay down and die for you. Listen to me now. I know what I'm talking about. Collective plot twist. The story's changing. Plot twist. The story's changing. What is, what's the story changing about, spirit guides? Somebody wants to jump you out in town. They're mad because you spoke on all the shit that they done and said about you or done to you. The story is changing about you. The story is changing about you. They're mad. It might be some blonde woman that screws around and lies and acts like she never did it and she does it all the fucking time and... And uh, it's because she was either raised by a narcissist or she lives with a narcissist. She is abused by the narcissist. And and um, when she challenges her narcissist's authority, then he gets mad. He puts the smack of down on her. Now, that's what it said. So, don't get mad at me. And I don't know who these stories are for. you got to remember, I'm doing this for the collective collective. And I love y'all. And if you notice, I got rid of that old energy. But it's new energy. See, somebody is... They're mad. They're mad at something that you said. They're mad at something you said. Now they're going to bust you upside the head. Plot twist, plot twist. And it might be about somebody needed to get out of a contractual agreement that needed to be broken. It's because it was toxic and it wasn't meant to stay together. So, so uh, maybe one of you twin flames is tied into a marriage and it's toxic and you needs to get out of it. And if you're a blonde woman, you need to get out of it. It's saying, but, you know, it might be saying that you need to get out of this broken contract because, hey, your partner is screwing a blonde woman behind your back. They're screwing a blonde woman behind your back. Hey, hey, I'm telling you right now, this person that acts like they just want to live and die, they die right for you and live in the casket for you. They're, they're doing uh, something behind your back. 
the, ta the toxic fuck of marriage needs to be broke because you've been mentally, physically, and, and psychologically abused. And, and it all went on behind closed doors. Twin Flames said, pay the fuck attention. Your intuition led you to me. I'm listening to every word you say. My soul loves you, and I'm the first one to hit like on, on your videos. Ah, that's what it just said for somebody. Spirit told me that's what it was. I'm telling you, truth. listen to me. Listen, listen. Listen, 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 mm -mm, listen. <laughs> Learn all the knowledge that you can so you can make an impact on the world. See, you're learning all this knowledge because, hey, you're meant to do something bigger. You and your twin flame is meant to do big things that these people do want to jump you. They want to kill you. They want to put you in the casket. That's what that meant. So, twin flame, remember now, honey, bunches of oats, they always want to kill us. They'll always want to kill us, Twin Flames. Oh, and you can't convince people who you truly are, can you, Twin Flames? No, don't even try to convince people. Let them have their own, let them draw their own conclusion. Okay, Collective, just let them draw their own conclusion because that's, that's what, they, that what everybody needs to do. Uh, but anyway, God is going to show these people through divine intervention your new person. So, you know, divine intervention do you see do you see how much god loves you oh listen listen to the bluebirds listen to the bluebirds or blue jays that come around your house listen listen to the blue birds or blue jays whisper whisper pay attention to yourself when you see them blue jays or blue birds that's what the hell it's telling you and they come to my house every day and fight for the food because I feed my birds because I love them. Oh, and we keep on healing all of humanity. Look, here's what me and my twin does. Twin flame powers ignite. Zzz, zzz, zzz. That's for people that is part of 144,000. And you're meant to come here to heal all humanity. And you got a greater purpose. And, you know... You've linked your lineage way long ago, and you might be from the Bible and telling people to straighten their act up, or the world's going to end. But, we know, you know, that's, that's for just some of us that knows that. That's for just some of us. The ones that smart, you better pay attention. Because at any time, the lights can go out for all of us. Yeah, pay attention. It will. And nobody is grateful uh, for me and my teachings anymore, it doesn't seem like. But it's all right, because I've got a lot of sacred wisdom. And I hope and pray that if anybody's listening to me that is uh, higher up than me, and you've got pull, I, I hope that you would help pull for me, because I know that my guidance is needed, and I just helped you all with letting you know that people do love you, whoever you are, collective, I love you, and somebody loves you a lot, and I know it. I know they love you a lot, but also some of you out here needs to get out of this toxic relationships that is narcissist. Uh, I love how it said that. I love you, spirit guide. Oh, 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 oh. Scared you'll find out that they blocked you. They cock blocked you, collective, and they blocked you, collective. They're scared you'll find out they blocked you. Uh, from this person that is emotionally dependent. They don't rely on you or anyone else to make them feel whole. And, you know, I've always been like that. I've always been happy with myself, even. All those mistakes just made me grow through the lesson. I learned my lesson. I didn't go back to doing dumb shit. So, whoever this is, that's uh, relying on you because you are a good person that speaks the truth. You're emotionally whole because you're led by the divine. You're a divine child. These people, they're scared. You'll find out that they blocked you from the love of your life. Well, I just told on them, didn't I, collective? And it said, I'd fight a bar for you, not a grizzly bar or a brown bar or even a panda bar, but maybe like a cow bar. I'd fight ones of those sons of bitches for you for sure. And that's my unknown. And remember, relationships are tough, and so are bears. And I'm sure there's a tough care bear out there for you. Stormy bear, stormy bear, care bear. So they blocked you from this this bear that has always cared for you and loved you. They blocked you. They caught blocked you so you wouldn't fight with them. 
whoever this is, this toxic marriage, they blocked you so you wouldn't fight with them. Uh, and, and they wanted to keep you trapped in illusion. See little Stormy Bear? Uh, but, but they didn't realize that their energy, uh, we can read it, you know, you and me can't collective, and you realize that they was always just bringing that fight energy. They was bringing that fight energy because, uh, you have that good energy and people flocks to you. They couldn't, they can't leave your good energy. They blocked you from the love of your life. Because they can't fucking lose your good energy and all your knowledge. That's why. But, you know, you and this twin of yours, you all have a strong bond between each other. And people will soon enough see it and know it. And so they will always send people to mess with it. But they don't realize that God always gives you what was meant for you. They don't realize. But they're getting ready to realize that they should have listened to my cards. Ah. <sighs> Right, Collective? These people that was going against God and not listening, and they knowed. And some of you knowed. And some of you did know. And some of you was waiting and waiting on someone to bring you some knowledge of if they loved you. If they was your twin. And it was all inside you the whole time. It was all inside you the whole time. And somebody said, fight for yourself now. Somebody's scared you'll find out that, uh, and now they're going to be scared because you're going to start fighting for yourself. They scared you'd find out you was blocking them. They was blocking you from somebody who loved you wholly, you know, and now you said, fuck you, I just found out, and now I'm going to fight. Uh, sorry, collective, I didn't mean to cuss. Would you please forgive me? I'm trying to not do that. But you're going to receive upgrades in your spirituality only after you speak your truth. To the people who was stopping you, upgrades coming. Well, I speak my truth every time it comes out over here, so don't worry. That's why upgrades always will come to me, because I help people in my collective. I do. I tell y'all who uh, is doing shit, so y'all better start paying attention. <coughs> and uh, you voice what you feel. You're brave enough to stand up to people who feels like they're better because they got more money than you do. So upgrades is coming because you voiced your opinion about these stupid people that went around lying said you screwed them they they went they go around drunk driving by your fucking house they uh you're you're gonna be amazed when you find out all this shit this man said about you that you was a goat digger and all this shit just so you wouldn't voice your opinion and be brave enough to stand up to all these people that was trying to stop you because they had more money than you and whoever that motherfucker is that lied on your name, that, that city boy, they be in that cocky energy. They're the cock of the walk. Oh, cock of the walk. You brave enough to stand up to cocky boys or cocky women that live in the city. Might have been a blonde boy or a blonde woman, but all I know is they had something to do with a lot of this bullshit. And you was brave enough to voice it. And good for you and good for me. And I helped somebody. <laughs> see? See how I help y'all? And you deserve love and to be happy. And yes, some people will try to steal your joy and light. But, you know, you're meant to walk away from people who are against you. See, that's what we're learning. You walk, you, you need to walk away from these cocky motherfuckers that thinks they're the cock of the walk. That cock of the walk, run from cock of the walk. They set you up for money. These motherfuckers and this blonde and whoever this man is that went around lying on your name. They, they did, and they know that your secret admirer is in love with you, and it's a Libra or Taurus, and uh, it's all in divine time, and y'all speak through telepathy. Look at this. <laughs> and whoever that song bitch is, they're just holding on to your good energy. And, and by Georgie, I want that energy gone from whoever's doing this to my collective. Get it gone, spirit guides. Get it gone. It's a celebration. Celebrate good times. Come on. It's a celebration. Me and you all, we're going to be up dancing around and just 
cutting a rug and having the funnest time of our life. Oh, gosh. It's coming. It's coming. Get grounded. It's coming, Collective. It's, oh, gosh. You know why? Oh, gosh. Because you're a beautiful old soul. Be proud of it. Because you are wise beyond your years. And you have a lot of knowledge to share with others. My ideas for my, me and my collective. You love it? Zzz. I'm the first artist. I am proud of it. Zzz. I'm the first artist that showed on these cards. If you see these running amongst all on YouTube, well, they copied from me. And then they started being like, oh, I want to be an artist. I'm going to be an artist. And they got more, more subscribers than me now. That's okay, artist. Because one day, everybody's going to know who the original motherfucker thought of it was. I'm sorry. Oh, ding, ding, bing, bing. <laughs> oh, yeah. Your, your twin knows you're telling the truth. My twin knows I'm telling the truth about. Um, I never seen anybody doing this artwork on these cards until I started doing it. And anybody that knows me knows I'm telling the truth. But I shut up. We're beautiful old souls. And somebody has thinking of making a bold and fast move to come to you, baby. But they don't want to fail with you. They're planning on this. They're planning on it. They're planning on it. It's your old soul love. So it is. And they feel guilty for wronging you. They feel guilty because they didn't come to tell the truth that they loved you. And you taught them to use their own discernment. And that will steal you, steer you away from evil people, places, and things that's not meant for you. And spirit will lead you to the light good side. See, they're getting a pounding headache because spirit has been leading them to you and to the light good side. And um, whoever this person is... They're, they doubt you. They doubt your. They doubt. They doubt something all the time. They're guilty because they didn't. They couldn't speak their truths to you. Whatever it may be, maybe they went around lying and said you was a gold deer. You just wanted money and whatever they went around lying about. You just had to realize that you can't doubt yourself and you you got to feel uh, good about yourself. You can't feel worthless or be around people who has that energy. Because if you're around people that has that energy, then you're going to feel worthless. And uh, you're not going to get away from this evil person. Now, are you listening? Spirit's guiding you that plan it all out well before you speak this truth. Okay? Don't doubt yourself. Don't doubt yourself because Spirit God said... We always lead you to who's good. I love you, Spirit Guides. You know how much I love them, Collective, and I love you all. And if you're new, I love you. Would you please hit subscribe or hit panel star oracle? Thank you. Thank you. But somebody might be planning on trying to leave you. Trying to leave you. They're doing something sneaky. Their spirit's trying to uh, warn you that this person that doesn't sleep well at night because they're guilty and they keep getting pounding headaches because they're doing something sneaky behind your back. That's why. That's this man at this, you need to run from collective, whoever it is that this is resonating with. You need to run from a motherfucker because they're keeping you impiced. They're doing energy manipulation work on you. That's why. Trying to make you not pay attention to your intuition. Old soul. That loves yourself very well. They was caught blocking you. They was caught blocking you because they was manipulating your energy. They was manipulating your energy, ma'am. Yep, yep, yep. Scared you'll find out. Remember, scared you'll find out that they was caught blocking you. Listen now. They didn't want you to go to celebration. No, they didn't want you to be emotionally dependent. They didn't want you to be by yourself and emotionally dependent of yourself or whatever it was. They didn't want you to because they know your old soul. And, and they know that uh, this, this emperor, your god twin, is watching you in the background. And because uh, they know, because... Uh, they didn't want you to use your intuition because they know that you would not want their, them. Well, you done told them, you know, when the truth comes out about them. See? They just doing, they're just manipulating you. Whoever this fucking man is is just manipulating you. They went around, I think, they get drunk and they go around and lie 
and they tell somebody, they tell a blonde that you're not sleeping with them and they're lying to that blonde and saying they're going to run away from you now. They're going to leave you now. That's what they're telling. And the, this man is lying to this woman that they caught on the side of the road. That's, that's all I can get out of that. I remember saying something about roads and gravel roads earlier. So they're fucking taking their cock and running it, running their cock into that woman right now. This is the present energy for somebody. That, and I'm brave enough to voice it. I'm brave enough to voice it. Because this person has more money than you do. Oh, did you hear that? So, well, probably because she gets paid for her services on the side of the road. That you're going and banging her on the side of the road. Sorry, I mean, don't get mad. That's what the story just said. That ain't me. But you got to accept that you're not always going to agree with everyone. And people ain't always going to agree with you either. You got to accept people's differences. You got to accept your differences and cut ties with it. That's what God's saying. With this, uh, with this, look, with this past life relationship, you got to cut ties with somebody from your past. This past karmic that needs to be left in the past is what it's saying. Uh, because the devil sent this person to block you re from receiving your blessings from the divine. So the they, they were just trying to keep you, the devil energy latched to you. But they know you're highly protected by the divine. Me and you are highly protected by the divine collective. Don't worry. We're highly protected. Listen to me. And you're working your way up the ladder. So be proud, honey. Keep working your way up that ladder. And uh, remember that when you see a crab, it may mean they're doing lunar magic on you, a spiritual person. Oh, yeah. Or maybe that blonde woman is a crab. And you've been speaking about it because you sensed it this whole time. And and you needed to sense it because Spirit was saying, wake up, plot, twist, fight for yourself. Fight for yourself so you can receive all your money and celebrations and your love of your life is coming to sit right on top of your lap. And he's going to make you feel him so big. Oh, God collective. Oh, but see, because Spirit is guiding me to tell you all how deceptive these people are. See, this is what I meant to do is to tell you all. But you're, you're going on a new path that is divinely guided. Scared you'll find out. Nah, don't be scared. I'm glad to find that out. Because they're trying to kill you off. Yep, they're trying to kill you off and kill your soul. But this person loves screwing people at you. You screw is what it's saying. You feel this person's energy. You feel whoever this whore is that they screw. You feel their energy. Yeah. You feel their energy collective. I say we bust on the side of the head, don't we? Who is it? Who is the woman? Who is it? We got five of cups. Oh, they're feeling lost and heartbreak because they can't see her on the side of the road all the time. Oh, God. That's the truth. What I said, they feel heartbreak over not being able to see her on the side of the road all the time. Collective. It's, it's killing them. It's killing them that this clarity has been coming out on my channel. Oh, that's the justice is for me over here, old Pamela. Pamela over here at Pound Star Oracle. I'm, a, I'm an Aquarius and I got all that Libra in me. All that Libra because I'm balanced and I'm able to say, hey, I bring the truth about this karmic justice. I'm the one that does that on Tarot Land. Oh, that's what my old soul has always been a judge. It's always been that. It's always. I help everybody though. Oh, and then here we got illusionary success. The karmic justice is that whoever this person is, they was meant, it, it was destined that they had to feel like they wasn't going to ever be a, be a success with you because they lied to you. They didn't tell the truth to you. That's why they're feeling in loss. Because the motherfucker know this lying to you this whole time. And they was trying to take dominion, dominion over your life. Two of wands. That's what it means in this deck. Yep. They just wanted dominion. But Princess of Pentacles, uh, Pentacles come out. There's, uh, they, they want dominion over. And they want it say so in your opportunities that you get or your jobs that you get or your friends that you get they had to have dominion over all that no 
Oh, and they're going, uh, they feel lost in, in this love relationship. Well, yeah, because you was being in that city cocky energy of fucking around a block. Sorry. And High Priestess saw through it. High Priestess over here. PG saw through all the bullshit. Yeah. Divine. You're highly protected by the Archangels. The Archangel Michael, I put it in a divine a long time ago. Truth is, you are a high priestess in your love relationship. The justice is you are empress. You know, you've birthed this new creation. This is whatever you're birthing to life at the moment. You're a damn high priestess uh, empress that brings justice. That's the truth. And this is about your perfected work. Four of Wands. This could be about a marriage, a celebration, a graduation. Uh, maybe this is about Empress. This is about your uh, marriage and how you try to tell others that no one will ever have a perfect marriage. There ain't no one on earth going to. That's an illusion to even ha have that idea. And I'll tell you, that is true, what I just said. But, uh, Valor, you had to stand up to that person that wanted dominion over your life.